Mark Mooberry loves the game of golf and has helped in operating the El Dorado Hills golf course for the past 15 years. But he and co-owner Eric Waddington are ready to move on after several slow years of business. Some point we've got to make a decision on what to do next and closing the doors unfortunately is the decision that we had to make. But that isn't striking the nearly 200 local property owners very well. We've researched a lot of uh, similar situations around the nation and we've come up to most of the values drop 15 to 20 percent is what we've, what we've seen. And you know, that's what we're trying to avoid is you know losing our golf course and our home values. Kevin is now trying to band the community together to form an ownership group for the golf course. He says the uncertainty over what could take the golf course's place is one of the driving factors for trying to keep the course operating. We don't we don't know what's going to come in here. You know, it, it could be apartment buildings. We just we wouldn't have any control over it because we wouldn't own it. And that's that's the the beauty of if we get you know we get this purchased that then we control our backyards for you know for the future. Reporting in Norfolk, Nebraska, Scott Larson, ABC9 News.